Hello ladies and gentlemen, Force here and welcome back to Diablo 2 Resurrected uh, The Nightmare Story uh, playthrough or the full and complete uh, walkthrough with uh, the Amazon As per usual I'm gonna continue the story Let me check my stats, 110 base, 120 and 100 for vitality and I think Yeah, I mean uh, Oh, we'll soon reach level uh, 54 and we'll have this one to the maximum, which is nice. Uh, I haven't found a single item that has no stats on it, so I could imbue and complete that quest, but I'll try to find one. And uh, I think we'll start with uh, talking to the uh, people in town. Welcome to Karas, traveler. Few come willingly to this ancient city anymore. I hope you brought your wits with you. For sanity is in short supply here. My name is Ratli. I am a sorcerer skilled in metal work. It'd be a pleasure to help you. I don't have many customers these days. As you can see, the populace has been brutally decimated by the forces of Mephisto. The canals run red with blood, and demons roam the land. The wretched jungle hell has already reclaimed much of Karas. The only safety you'll find is here at the dark side, where a magical warning holds a jungle evils at bay. But I don't know how long it will last. To make matters worse, the children of Zakarum are in league with the forces of Mephisto. The Zakarum have concentrated their power in the temple city of Travancore. Located within Karas, deep in the jungle wilderness. It's true, their zeal is unmatched, but I say the so called warriors of light are nothing more than the twisted puppets of a hidden hand. Okay, let's see if you have anything that has no stats, so I could get rid of that. Uh three socketed axe that might be nice for a barbarian of course nothing that has no stats just the basic item hmm. okay uh, let's go here first and uh, I'm quite impressed. Very few mortals are capable of dealing with the three and their minions as you have. My name is Natalia. I am a hunter of evil, part of an ancient order sworn to hunt down corrupted sorcerers. If I could, I would gladly join your quest to stop the three. But I must wait here for further news. I can't predict what will happen, but the danger is greater than we can know. Until I receive my orders, assist you with the information I have. Okay then, uh, I guess we can talk to Deckard Kane and uh, other people uh, that are uh, here. I've not set foot in glorious Kurast for many years, but I never would have imagined it could be so corrupted. Certainly, this must be Mephisto's work. You'd best get going, my friend. Diablo and Bale are still out there, and you must find them. You now speak to Ormus. He was once a great mage, but now lives like a rat in a sinking vessel. You have questions for Ormus, and doubt in yourself. Ormus sees a strange dichotomy in you, as he does in all would-be heroes. Speak to him, and he may grant you wisdom in turn. 
or turn from him and seek wisdom in thyself. Hello there. You must be an Amazon. I've heard about your people. Nomadic warriors without peer. My name's Ashira, and I lead the mercenary band of mages known as the Iron Wolves. We've been hunting down demons in the jungle for months. But no matter how many of them we kill, they just keep coming. Seems this whole place has been overrun by evil. Rumor has it that you've come here to help. If that's true, then I'll let you hire some of my mercenaries. But be careful. If you piss them off, they can be worse than those monsters out in the jungle. Okay, so uh, I think there's only one uh, more person to talk to. Alcor, the alchemist. You people would just leave me alone. I... Oh, you're new here, aren't you? I am Alcor the Alchemist. I dabble in potions and salves, and I can sell you some if you really need them. But don't make a habit of coming here. I don't like to be disturbed while I'm studying. Okay then, so I guess we'll start. As per usual, trying to clear everything out. What would this bring from the right buyer? Good day! Back in Loot Golain, Meshif told me he had a fondness for jade figurines. On his trading voyages, he collected an odd assortment of such small statues. I would show him your figurine. This fetid jungle can't be the fair Kurost I left behind. 
I don't know what all this evil is, my friend, but it's obvious that you must stop it. I only pray that you can before the jungle consumes the last vestiges of my beloved homeland. Praise you. That jade figurine will complete the set I was collecting. Here, I've had this statuette of a golden bird for years, but I consider it a fair exchange. I've read legends about a sage named Kuile, who studied the mysteries of life beyond death. If I remember correctly, his ashes were ensconced within a golden statuette. It was a very strange tale. See what I've made for you. Greetings. From the ashes of Quile, I have mixed for you a portion. Forget that your ultimate purpose here in Kurast is to destroy Mephisto. The ancient Horodrim imprisoned the Lord of Hatred inside the Guardian Tower that is located within the temple city of Travancore. Know this, friend. The only way to gain entry to Mephisto's prison is to destroy the artifact known as the Compelling Orb. Mephisto used this device to control the Zakarum priests and their followers. The orb can only be destroyed with an ancient flail imbued with the spirit of the one incorruptible priest. Soon after his imprisonment, Mephisto worked his evil corruption on the Zakarum priesthood. All were turned to his dark ways, save one. Kalim, the Kay Hagen of the High Council. Mephisto directed the other council priests to slay and dismember Kalim, and then scatter his remains across the kingdom. The priest Sankakur succeeded Kalim as Kay Hagen, eventually becoming the embodiment of Mephisto here on the mortal plane. The corrupted High Council fashioned an orb to control the rest of the Zakarum faithful and used their powers to hide the lair of their master from mortals. Your task is to collect the scattered relics of Kalim, his heart, his brain, and his eye. Then, using the Horodric Cube, transmute Kalim's flail with his relics. Once this is accomplished, you must destroy the compelling orb with Kalim's will to open the way into the corrupt sanctum of Mephisto. Okay, we'll do just that. Find uh, Kalim's relics, search for, she, uh, for his eye in the spider cavern. So we are uh, in the spider forest. Uh, let me pick up my charm. My charms. Uh, let's go here first. I can't carry anymore.
Okay, so this is the first uh, dungeon. Uh, so let's go here first. Just because I'm close, I want to clear it out. That's just a dead end. Okay. Good thing that I went there first. That's a unique. Let's go to town. Yes. Defense 108. Plus 1 to all skills. Plus 15% faster uh, run uh, or walk. Plus 100% per, uh, enhanced defense. Plus 22 vitality. Plus 22 uh, energy. Replenish life. Plus 6. Uh, let's see about this one. Enhanced damage. Attack rating, ah, that's better for me. I could switch those, but I'm not gonna deal. Oh, I'm dealing more damage. A freezing arrow and uh, strafe. Uh, the rating, but the damage is lower. Hmm. I think I'll keep that for a hammered in. Oh, by the way, I created some characters that are just for storage, because I'm running out of space. One million and a, and a half gold. We're doing good.
mana. Okay, this area seems cleared. Uh, let's get out then. Uh, I need some mana. Hopefully, I'll find some uh, along uh, the way. I don't want to go to town so often. I found a room. Nice. It causes uh, monsters to flip plus 25%. <laughs> Equipped on weapons and armor, helms and shields replenish life plus 7. That's nice. Uh, this seems to be going uh, somewhere else, so let me go back across that uh, river and check out what's over here. I am overburdened. Okay, so this leads back. To know. Another rune. So I think I have uh, three drops the most runes. Interesting. I need mana. Yeah. Let's go to town. Good to see you. Another rune. Getting tons of runes. Good. I can't carry anymore. I need mana.
Uh, this one plus nine to uh, minimum damage. Oh, that's nice. Again, I need to go to town to get mana, as per usual. Good day. Good day. I tried to dodge that, but I failed. So we're still in the spider forest. I'm gonna go on this side until uh, there's a dead end or uh, I can go uh, anywhere else and then come back and check the other side. This looks like a dead end, okay. That means it's time to go back. Ow. Uh, this is just a small island connected by two bridges. Um, I think I'll go back. Oh, come on. My mana, it's gone. Completely gone. My god. Yes. 
I am overburdened. Not enough mana. Okay, so that leads to Great Marsh, but I don't need to be there, or at least not yet. Spider Cavern, yeah, that's uh, that's where we need to be. First, let me check around. Maybe there's something good around here. Not so interesting as I thought. Okay. Just leveled up. Let me see if there is uh, any mana here. Only a rejuvenation potion. Well, uh, dexterity or strength. Let's go with dexterity to increase my damage. And as I said, I'm gonna assign the last point here. And now we have base 20, which is maximum, but we have uh, practically instead of 20, we have 21 because we have uh, on our bow a plus one to all bows and crossbow skills. So this one has a 220% attack rating, cold damage 369 to 380, and freeze for uh, only two seconds, and mana cost 14. Now, uh, as I realized, uh, Pierce and Penetrate, I think Pierce adds uh, mana points. I don't know why, but it does. I think we're gonna uh, continue trying to reach this one to level uh, to 100% chance of piercing. But I'm not sure if that's a good idea. Because uh, I realized that using the Valkyrie when you're uh, fighting a boss... Uh, uh, to create distractions for that boss it's much easier for you to uh, take a, a step uh, behind and uh, be safe and uh, on the, the enemy with uh, arrows with the freezing arrow so that's also useful and also kind of keeps the enemies away from you uh, even if you're uh, fighting those uh, small guys ow I don't have any more mana. I need mana. Not enough mana. Okay, let's go to sound then. If that's uh, if that's how it's going to be, a lot of going back and forth with yes. the mana. 22 to attack rating, that's kind of low. I have better, uh, better rings with more uh, attack rating than that. I sold that because I don't need it, but I have uh, three gems uh, of the same type that I could uh, that I could combine. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank you for the follow. Nice to see people uh, joining, seeing some traffic. I know it's boring to see the uh, story of the game, but it's getting boring for me too. But uh, I just want to be done with it and finish it so I could start farming and creating builds and characters and all that good stuff. So yeah, that's why uh, I need to get rid of it and uh, since I'm up for uh, playing the story because I need to finish it, I said why not, let's stream it. Also our, those streams, basically every th every uh, stream that I've uh, done it's uploaded on YouTube so people uh, over there too won't be missing anything. I need to put somewhere safe my charms because there's a few items that I need to pick. This trident for example. And Kalim's eye. Uh, I need a portal though. Good evening. Ah, Kalim's eye. Only it can reveal the true path to Mephisto. Place the eye in the Herodric cube along with Kalim's other relics the heart, the brain, and the flail. I picked up that trident just to sell. Good evening. Just to sell. I'm basically not using those... Uh, I never used and never liked spears in uh, Diablo. Not that I used in other games uh, similar weapons. Uh, I do have a mana potion here. We're looking good on health. Let me get back to get my charms. I am overburdened. Yeah, overburdened. No joke. Six gold, okay. 90. At this point, those charms that I've got are good, but until I get something better to replace them, because I have uh, on me charms only for gold and uh, attack rating. Uh, gold attack rating and poison, I'm sorry. Because uh, this uh, character, this build that I'm working on, because it's still a work in progress, either, uh, even if I'm playing the story, I'm still working on the build. But I prefer uh, to farm, completing the story on all three difficulties, to be able to uh, farm uh, further uh, in the game on hell difficulty, defeating the bosses, doing boss runs and all that uh, stuff. Uh, and this build is based on uh, freezing uh, abilities, freezing arrow, strafe, uh, a lot of poison damage, and uh, mana and uh, lifesteal. I think the map looks cleared, I guess we can... Uh, okay, uh, okay then, uh, we can get out. But as I've said, I'm clearing everything out for the sake of the experience and uh, leveling up. Uh, I searched uh, some time ago... Some time ago, that being said, two years ago, when I was playing Diablo 2 Resurrected, I searched for... Uh, uh, how much uh, uh, experience uh, you get if you kill uh, basically every enemy in the game or uh, what level you'll have after finishing the, the story of the game on all three difficulties I and I can't remember it uh, for, uh, for the very life of me what uh, level uh, would I have 80? 81? 70? I can't remember but either way it's, I think it's better this way because uh, I don't have the hell uh, difficulty unlocked. And I'm not sure if you have to unlock the hell uh, difficulty uh, with every character to be able to farm or play on that uh, uh, difficulty. Oh, sorry. Tried to close the map. And uh, basically went and almost closed the game. I hate those tiny guys. I can't even uh, hit them. 
Uh, do I have? I have enough space to pick that ring. That's because I'm uh, almost running out of mana again. There's an identifying scroll which shall damage you reduced by two. Hmm. Not something that I'm very, very grateful for. But either way. Adds 2 to 10 cold damage, 12 to maximum stamina. That's kinda nice for the cold damage. Uh, that's a dead end. Okay, that means I need to go around through here. At least I uh, was able to get rid of uh, those guys from afar. Mm, nothing here. Okay. I swear to god that I'm, uh, I'm almost uh, jump scared every time uh, my Valkyrie pops in and out. See? All of a sudden unexpected. Quite a few times I got a bit scared and attacked. Because I was uh, thinking that's an enemy then I realized, oh hold on, that's just my friend. It happened to me in other games too. Like attacking somebody because I thought they're the enemy, but they weren't. As long as uh, they're uh, NPCs, I don't think that's a problem. But if you're playing uh, online with friends and you hit them and you deal damage to them because you got scared they're uh, the enemy, eh, I think that's that's not okay. That guy died just by watching me. Nothing here. Okay. Still nothing useful. And oh, wait a second, just to check the map to see. That looks completed. I've seen an area that leads to Great Marsh. The Spider Cavern, it's empty. So uh, there's one more place to check around here. And then uh, th through here we, uh, we're we going to the Great um, uh, Marsh. But I could swear in the spider jungle, uh, uh, spider jungle there would be another uh, thing, the Gidbin, for the second quest of this act. Not sure if it's uh, in the spider jungle, uh, a spider jungle, spider forest, or uh, the um, what's called the flare jungle. I don't remember. It's been a while since I was battling those guys uh, here in Act Three. Quite a few episodes in quite a few days. I don't tend to have that strong of a memory. I do know things and keep them in my memory, but uh, not uh, where uh, there's uh, the gate bin and all that stuff. The location, exact uh, exact locations on of things. That wasn't my strong point. And I forgot, again, not to arrange my stash, because I, I ran out of stamina. I ran out of stamina in a very, very long time. That's something. Uh, let's see if this area leads to somewhere new or uh, 
that's just it and then oh no seems there's more of this area I can't carry anymore hmm interesting I ran out of uh, mana again uh, as uh, I was trying to say uh, about the location of things I don't tend to remember all of those because uh, that's not such an important thing for me uh, for me it's more important it's uh, how to get uh, better gear how to create gear how to farm where to farm how much to farm at a boss or something uh, along those lines uh, 11 to max tony 1 to attack rating at 2 to 10 call damage yeah and as i've said before i created some characters just for storage because i don't have any more space anywhere not my inventory not my stash not the shared uh, stash pages so i created characters and named them storage a storage b storage c just to get more space uh, yesterday I got quite a few good items, especially that uh, uh, staff for the sorcerers with that 100% uh, uh, mana uh, regeneration after hit. And uh, well, while I was, uh, after I finished the stream yesterday, I was thinking, I think I'm a masochist. Okay, that sounds weird in itself, but hear me out first why would I because uh, yesterday I said weird things again that didn't make any sense or they were just uh, awkward uh, or cringy why would I put myself in those types of uh, situations or conundrums and then suffer from my own stupidity if I uh, am not a masochist yeah it sounds weird but I think that's how I level with it that makes any sense keep running out of mana that's one thing that i for sure hate I am overburdened. okay let's get some more mana in my stash my sash again confusing the stash with the sash If I would hit my target, that would be better. Because at this point, not hitting my target, uh, the only thing that does, it's not getting me killed, it's wasting my mana. So we are in the Great Marsh now, okay. I think the Gidbin it's in the Flare Jungle, if I remember correctly. Lord knows, I don't know. What the? Yeah, that makes sense. That's a boss, and that was a minion. That's why that minion was jumping like that. Giving me, uh, giving me gold game. Keep giving me gold because I need the gold. As I have a bad feeling about the hell difficulty. Another boss. Oh, also yesterday while uh, while clearing uh, a lot of the dungeons, especially the post tombs of uh, Tal Rasha, I ran into a lot of uh, a lot of bosses. That's not bad. More experience. A good chance of uh, finding something useful. 
If you would stop jumping, please. Okay, let's go to town. Because running out of mana, it's not something uh, that I enjoy. There's a uh, thing here, a well. Arrows, I could pick those up just to get myself a full quiver. And let's head to town. I, am overburdened. I didn't try to pick that up. Good day. Yes. Oh, oh, again, almost closed the game. Me and my, uh, spazzing, uh, sp me and my spasms, better said. Clicking like crazy on the keyboard. Like I'm banging a song at, on the piano. On I am yeah. Uh, let's see what's over here. Because there might be a dungeon. No. Oh, also, last time I played this game on the normal difficulty, I forgot to check out the Great March for the waypoint. And had to go all the way back to get the waypoint. Which I did. Killing him in rejuvenation. I think the uh, this is where the waypoint is. I think, not sure though. Anything useful? That jewel, some uh, mana. Uh, let me drop the mana potions here. Make more space. Get that mm, mana potion. Mana, mana. Super mana. No, so this is not where the waypoint is. Okay. Just a side area. That means more gold for me. Which is not bad. Not bad at all. Haha, uh -huh, miss me. That looks like a dead end, but it could uh, stretch around uh, over this bridge, I guess. And I think it does. Hmm. Nothing that I'm uh, grateful for. Not enough 
thing that I came here because it's just a dead end. I don't have to come uh, all the way back later to check it out to make sure it's a dead end. Alright. Let's drop those uh, mana potions. I'll soon be needing to go to town again. Okay, let's go to town because I really need the mana. Stay a while and listen. Greetings. The most uh, effective way to use the prison arrow is uh, to get all the enemies in one uh, huge pack and then plow them with uh, those prison arrows. Two, three arrows, all of them are done. If they are uh, just minions. At this point, I'm just uh, scouring the scouring, scouting the area to see. Uh, uh, which oh so here from uh, here on it's the flare jungle which I don't need to be right now in this also does the same so that means I can uh, go back I haven't got the waypoint for this area also and I need to be on the lookout last time I played the game uh, the waypoint of the great marsh was kind of hidden I don't know why was kind of hidden I didn't even saw it on the map uh, until I went and checked out every place. Uh, there's a bridge here. This is the waypoint. Good. Hidden in plain sight. Wouldn't be the first time. And certainly not the last. Okay, we're getting uh, back into the flare jungle, I guess. Just let me get rid of those guys and I'll uh, head back to that area which I left unchecked. I do need to start collecting, uh, collecting, uh, picking up uh, scrolls of a uh, town portal. Because I'm running out of those uh, two.
long war bow. Hmm. Just uh, I just want to check how many sockets that uh, bow has. Three sockets. Hmm. There's no point in creating another edge bow. I think uh, this edge thing, uh, the runes, give you uh, every bow that you have. Doesn't matter if it's just a normal attack speed, fast attack speed, very fast attack speed, slow attack speed. Doesn't matter. The edge gives you very fast attack speed to all the uh, all of the bows, which is a very good thing to have, especially if you're playing uh, as an Amazon uh, uh, based uh, something on poison, fire. Basically everything. This could be a, be a very good bow if you're uh, creating a, a character, an Amazon character based on poison, and uh, then uh, multi shot or, uh, or multi arrow or how that skill it's called, uh, the mul a multiple shot. Yeah, this one would be uh, such an amazing thing. Guided arrow. That's also a good uh, thing because it searches for the enemy by itself. You just shoot. And uh, sh the arrow searches for the enemy. Uh, strafe does kind of the same, but shoots uh, multiple targets. You click once, and then uh, the character moves and shoots uh, certain targets that are in the range of attack. Uh, three socketed bow. I think I should pick this one up. I haven't seen a, lo a long war bow uh, with three sockets. I don't know, since I started playing this one. This is a short war bow. It's a huge difference between long war bow. This adds uh, 3 to 20 damage. This is 6 to 14. You could increase the damage uh, with uh, this one by creating something with the runes. Uh, let me get, since I'm in town, let me get uh, something uh, useful. Mana, scrolls, anything that I need. And I'll be heading back. There was a point where I was uh, carrying... Oh, I'm still carrying keys with me. So I should uh, start collecting those too, because uh, I might uh, find myself upon a locked chest. Let me tell you in the normal difficulty how many times uh, I just ran up uh, a locked chest. When I opened it, it was really something good inside it. And uh, yeah. On the uh, Nightmare difficulty, I haven't found, I think, a locked chest that give, uh, gave me anything useful than mana, gold, maybe a yellow item, some blues, nothing that uh, useful. So basically, the Great Marsh, it's completed. Also the Spider Forest, that's how it's looking. Okay then, uh, I guess we can proceed uh, clearing uh, or starting uh, to clear the flare uh, jungle.
I can't carry anymore. Not enough mana. Uh, let's see what's over here. Might be a dungeon or a side dungeon. I can't carry anymore. I am overburdened. Also, if you're playing uh, this game, uh, if you're playing uh, on this act, watch out for those masks or something weird that looks like a giant totem, part of a human or something that's like a totem on the ground. Uh, just cut my mic, sorry, because uh, I was saying watch out for those because uh, those things are traps and you could get yourself killed. Especially if you're playing on a normal difficulty and you get the poison thing or some fire in your face and you're uh, low on health. This whole jungle is filled with weirdos and weird things. Also found the waypoint to the flare jungle which is a good thing. The swamp pit level 1. Okay then, let's get inside. A dungeon. Oh, that hurt. I am overburdened. How did those gloams got here? That's uh, how I want to know because I died from them. Oh, that's a... that's a boss. Yep, not the first time I died in a game, but I'm glad uh, it's not uh, Diablo the Beelzebub mod. That game, it's such a big piece of trash. Such a douchebag. Got me killed so many times, I just rage quit that game. Good day. Now, hopefully... I can get to where I need to be and try to get my body back. That sounds weird. And that's the thing. Lucky for me that I was close. I think I'll open a portal at the entrance of the dungeon somewhere where I'm safe. Impossible. Uh, opening a portal. That's what I, I was trying to do. I am overburdened. Impossible. Okay, got my body. Ooh. Uh, great mana, great healing, uh, mana, 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 mana. Yeah, you can't carry anymore. Do I have any healing, super healing? No, I guess I'll pick up the greater healing. That's much better. I'll pick another mana potion to have on me. Just for uh, when the time comes. What? What did I just... Oh, there was so, those tiny guys. I heard something and I didn't know uh, what I heard. Sounded weird. I need money. As you can see, my friend was shooting the wall, making it uh, explode. Because she was not hitting her target and I thought that's an enemy shooting fire at me. Try to attack my friend again. Just stay in one place for the love of God.
okay, it leads to level 2, but I want to clear level 1 too. For the sake of uh, leveling up. That sound was weird, and it kind of scared me. I need to be very careful in those tight uh, co corners because I almost died again. Lucky for me that was uh, a health potion uh, going up, uh, raising my uh, health. <laughs> and you would think I would do great because I uh, have uh, 500 uh, and something health points. I don't know what's wrong with uh, those enemies, they seem to have a, a beef with me, because I'm almost dying. Twice, I almost died twice, and died once to one of those gloom things. I am Found another rune. I can't carry anymore. Now, I'll for sure pick that one. Let's head to town.
after all this trouble, uh, the uh, next level it better give me something very good because I almost died quite a few times and died also once. Better give me something good. This place it's huge. That's a dead end. the room Let me see if there is any mana. Super healing, that's okay. A key. I guess that's it. Nothing great. <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time.
Okay, I think we can get out of this place. And let's head back. Okay, so I'm kind of running out of stamina. Uh, let me regenerate my stamina slowly and uh, I'll continue clearing this uh, flare jungle. And head uh, where I need to be, even though I don't know where I'm supposed to be right now. I know that I need to find the flare dungeon and uh, the gitbin. Went easy. Just a dead end. Okay. Let's go around again. Uh, I guess. Thanks for the portal. I needed a, uh, I needed a portal either way, so uh, why not use it? Greetings. Good day. Hello. I'm gonna sell that. It's been a while since I uh, saw a yellow necklace. I got uh, some uh, set pieces as rings. And I think only two yellow necklaces that I have found uh, in the entirety of the time that I played this game. I was expecting for something unique, but I don't even know for sure if there is a unique uh, necklace. Could be, could not be. Or knows, I don't.
I can't carry anymore. Getting a lot of gems. Not bad. Uh, Superman. I guess I could pick that up. Let's go through here. I think I can pick uh, some uh, more keys. Oh, and also I haven't found uh, a locked chest in this act since I started. Not even one. I got the grand charm here, which I'm curious what's about it. I'm gonna go to town identified. That's one to took all damage. Not even close to helpful. Want maximum damage. The same. I have so many perfect uh, diamonds. I think I should start using them. I think we're uh, where we're supposed to be. Not sure though. Yeah, we are where we're supposed to be. Now, uh, if we, uh, we could only find the Gidwin. Leveled up. Which is great. Uh, let's go for uh, more points of uh, dexterity. So I have 100, uh, 130 dexterity right now. Let's see about the skills. It could, this could increase my pierce chance to 69% or I could increase the damage of this one strafe hmm. I think I'll go with pierce because as I've said I'll, uh, I'm trying to reach 100% pierce with this one. I can't carry Not sure how long it's gonna take though. Okay, so that's the flare uh, dungeon, which we need to be in. No problem. I haven't found the Gidbin. No. Then it should be somewhere here, I think. Other area, I guess. I don't know. Okay, let's go into that dungeon. Because I need to be there either way. Let's go there. First, and then uh, we'll uh, take care of uh, the Gidbin. Or not? Did I need to press that? I don't remember. Yeah, we found the Gidbin. I can't carry anymore. This dagger will separate the faithful from the fallen. Stay a while and listen. You have done well, noble hero. Ormus congratulates you. The old spirits of Skatsim will watch over you for returning their sacred blade. Now. After all these years, Ormus will once again use his powers to protect the innocent from the shadow. The spell that protects the dark side shall now be reinforced. Uh, let me buy some more mana. More potions, I'm gonna drop that gem in my stash. 
Uh, I do have only one of those. So I can't combine them for now. Now uh, let me get back my uh, charm. There's some arrows here. I am overburdened. Uh, also, if you don't know, if uh, only if you if you have the inventory it's filled. For example, as I have all of those charms, and uh, you need more arrows. Uh, for example, you can uh, just uh, close the inventory, see where's the quiver on the ground, click on it. It says uh, the character that it's overburdened or uh, can't carry anymore, but uh, the arrows will stack up uh, back to 500, the maximum uh, amount a quiver can hold. If I could hit my target, that would be amazing. Got the unique light plated boots. Which I need to throw away. Oh, throw away. Just drop my charms to get those. More mana. Not bad. Let's go to town. I think I got another uh, unique uh, light plated boots uh, some time ago. Good day. But I'm still itching for something better than this one that I have. I equipped it because it was better than uh, something unique. Yeah. Defense 33, 25% chance for of crushing below, 51% enhanced defense, plus 15 defense, damage reduced by one, magic damage reduced by one, minus one to light radius. Oof. Let's see how that affects my stats. Increases my maximum. Uh, no, doesn't uh, increases. It's uh, low. It lowers my damage. Lowers my uh, rating. See, even if it's a, a unique, you uh, can't uh, be sure if it's a good unique or something that's useful for your character. That's why uh, the farming uh, comes to play the role of uh, creating a better character. Thirty-five to attack rating, six to energy, poison resist plus ten percent, magic damage reduced by one. What I have here is much much better. So uh, sorry, friend. I think I'll um, yes. sell it. Bye bye. At this point, I have way too many rings. Way too many rings. Only one necklace that I kept. I think this was the first necklace that I've got. And I equipped it because it had uh, the attack rating on it. But uh, I kept to a lot of rings. For example, this one I've got yesterday. 142 mana. That's good for a sorceress. For example, or something that's... Uh, uh, that you need mana, but you can't uh, throw uh, a lot of... Uh, or at all, for example. I haven't put any... Uh, energy points base value is 15 i have 24 uh, because of my gear but if i remove my gear i have the base value 110 strength 130 dexterity 100 points that's the maximum uh, with uh, this build for health and 15 points that's the base thing that you start uh, the character with and no points added to magic so uh that's good for example for this character but uh, what i have equipped uh restores my mana adds more life and regenerates and helps uh, steal more mana and uh, health from enemies once I hit them or once they're uh, dead. Also this one I kept because it's a uh, 79 to attack rating, some resistances too. For example this one 114, a lot of rings with attack rating that I kept and uh, gold uh, uh, from enemies. I wish uh, there would have been uh, another uh, thing uh, like uh, getting more mana from uh, chests or other things. Large charm, I haven't identified that one. 
but uh, I'll go down and do that just now, just by curiosity to see what's that about. Greetings. Oh, he's there. Five to dexterity. Hmm. It's okay, but not great. It's not something that I'm very, very uh, great uh, grateful for. Let me get uh, back my charms. Get out of dodge. Dead end. Great. There's bound to be a unique item between those fingers crossed. No, only a yellow. I am overburdened. Let me see, uh, let me pick first the gold and everything else that I think uh, is necessary. For example, mana. Greater healing, super mana, healing, town portal, town portal, because I'm kind of using those. That ring. And that's it. Okay then. Uh, let me throw, uh, as per usual, my charms. Let's go to sound identify those cells if I don't need them. Yes. Hello. Want to energy? Be real. That's not. Uh, that's not something that's really helpful. Found another uh, rune. Uh, let me drop uh, the mana in my sash. Pick that up. I can't carry anymore. Oh, found the layer. Uh, the layer. Found the stairs to level two. Okay, then let's see what's over there, and then I'll uh, continue to level 2. Okay, so was nothing there, then on to the level 2. Thank you. 
overburdened. Oh, my sash is filled with mana. I need mana. I am overburdened. Currently, I can't hit my targets. Level 2. Okay, so this leads uh, to level 3. Let me see if there is anything in that room. Yeah, some gold. Not bad. We do need uh, all the gold that we can get. Because those mana potions are not cheap. And, uh... Plus... I'm running out of mana so fast and I keep popping into town to buy more. Also the scrolls of town portal are, aren't touch either. Where is this leading to? Come on, this is a maze. Wanted to find uh, the end of the map, corner of the map, and I find I found the end of the world. Greetings. Greetings. found a unique amulet. I was just talking about those. Uh, I need to see super mana, greater mana, greater mana, super mana. Uh, let's get that uh, Kalim's brain because I need it for the quest. I'll open a portal, go to town. I'm really curious about that necklace because I think it's the first unique necklace that I've got or the second. Good to see you. This is most fortunate. Kalim's brain knows Mephisto's weakness. Place it in the Herodric cube along with Kalim's other relics. The eye, the heart, and the flail. Good day. 
Let's check this one out. 20 plus 20 percent faster hit recovery adds 3 to 6 fire damage plus 10 to maximum fire resist fire resist plus 50 percent plus 3 to light radius no kozan relic hmm. not bad for a unique but i don't think it's gonna help me my character this character I lose some health, but my damage is increased. 500 points of health. Uh, let's see. I don't know uh, which one disappears. Only 85% extra gold from monsters. Hmm. This one has 7 damage take when go goes to mana. Hmm. For to life. I guess. I guess I could. Uh, I'll leave that. I'm not gonna throw it away. Because it has that uh, gold thing. But I'm not saying. Um, okay, my damage is increased. But I'm not sure if uh, I will be dealing a lot more damage to the enemies comparing to uh, the amount of damage I've been uh, dealing uh, until now. I am overburdened. I am dealing more damage, but not well, a huge amount. It's not one uh, shot kill enemy. It's not OP. But it's still a bit better. I lose some health, uh, some uh, regeneration, some health or mana percentage. But uh, I'm uh, clearing uh, the dungeon or uh, dealing uh, more damage to the enemies. So. Yeah, first unique necklace that I've got. And it's not uh, quite bad. It's okay. It's not something that's wow. It's it's okay. Okay, I can uh, I think talk to uh, talk to Ashira, search Kalim's heart in the sewers. Okay, then uh, let's go out. And uh, once I'm out of this dungeon, uh, I'll head to town because uh, we need to complete that quest. Uh, we need to talk to Ashira. There's some mana, which I forgot to pick up. Because you know, there's more mana, which I forgot to pick up. Because you know my affinity for mana. Without it, I can't do anything. Stamina uh, shrine, that's good. Allows me to wander, uh, wander those places. Uh, quite often, quite often, uh, more, uh, and uh, I want to be uh, running out of stamina. Yeah, uh, in this act, it's the first time in a very, very long time that I ran out of stamina. Yeah, in the f uh, first uh, playthrough of this game, I uh, used uh, a lot of uh, stamina potions, but uh, now since I entered uh, the nightmare difficulty. I haven't used, I think, yes. two, three stamina potions total. Good day. Uh, anything from you? No. Okay, then let's head to Ashira directly. Great. Now that fewer of the Iron Wolves are needed to guard the dark side, some of them have volunteered to accompany you free of charge. Hidden. I'll head back and continue clearing that player jungle because I think it's not uh, completed. We found the git bin, we found uh, uh, the thing that uh, we got. That thing. 
Kalim's brain, I think I uh, got in this uh, dungeon. The next area, I don't even know what's the name of the next area, because I, I, as I've said, my memory is not fixated on uh, things that aren't so important. For sure, for sure, for real. You guys can take any uh, care of uh, anything if I'm not uh, involved. I can't carry anymore. You need to start stacking those uh, numbers up, those killing numbers. Come on. I found a flail. Uh, for sure, it's uh, three socketed, I think. Uh, but I have already one that's to a paladin, and I don't. I don't think I'll be needing uh, uh, any paladins beside uh, the hammered in paladin build that I will uh, be working on. God knows when. I am overburdened. There's a thing here. Let's go to town, identify that one. Nothing interesting. Enhanced damage, six, uh, 7 to maximum damage. Nothing interesting. Damage reduced by 2. Nothing interesting. I could get the health potion and uh, two more uh, mana potions. Okay, so I found where we need to be, but I'm not gonna go inside there before uh, clearing completely the player uh, jungle.
Okay, so I think the map is uh, uh, completely cleared. Uh, just let me take a look. Make sure it's completed. Yeah, okay then. We can head to the Great Marsh. The Great Marsh. The Cross, the... Uh, something, Cross Bazaar or what's that? Not the Great Marsh. The Great Marsh is way behind. I am overburdened. Overburdened. Okay, so while I'm here, I'm gonna take a short break and be back in the jiffy. So, BRB.
Okay, so I'm back. Uh, let's continue. For some stupid reason, the audio got muted. I don't know why. Good evening. Now it's okay. Don't ask me what happened because I don't know. I'm checking for some uh, runes currently uh, to combine because I think I've got an armor that uh, could be very helpful but uh, it will be unlockable on level 61 and uh, checking to see uh, if I have I think I have only one of uh, what I need. No. Wait a second. Yeah, I don't have any of those. Oh well, then uh, let's get back to where we were, I guess.
good day. Greetings. I am overburdened. Overburdened. For well, now, I'm just uh, checking uh, everything out and uh, making sure that I cleared everything. Getting a lot of uh, gems. Don't know what's happening, but I would prefer more runes. 
so I could start uh, crafting that uh, those runes for uh, crafting, combining those runes for uh, that piece of armor. Anymore. As I've said, a lot of gems. Let's go sound then. Okay, found another uh, waypoint. I think the map is cleared. So uh, we can head now where uh, we should be or uh, where we need to be. Oh, come on, where it is? Oh, here, down here. Okay. Uh. 
There are some dungeons uh, in this area too. I need to go to town. Yes. Yes. Okay, found the next point, uh, waypoint, which is good. Now the only thing remaining is to clear this area up, uh, including the dungeons. That's the upper frost. I am overburdened. Nothing interesting about that. I should uh, let me see I just want to see what's uh, with this uh, weapon I don't I didn't even pick that up oh my god that's such a bad performance on my part
I can't carry anymore. Okay, the map seems kinda partially completed. A lot of chests too. Quite a lot of them. Didn't even saw those guys. I need mana. Where did that guy came from? Ah, oh, he opened the. Uh, he opened. He entered uh, through uh, here. I thought he teleported. Well, uh, let's get rid of uh, those guys too. Not enough mana. Let me see, mana, rejuvenation, mana... I do have some mana. Nothing else remaining. Uh, do you have any mana? No. Okay. Whoa. I swear those guys are like they're planning to scare me. Found a rune. That's it game, give me runes. Give me the more runes you give me, the happier I'll be. Because I need the runes. To start uh, combining them uh, with the gems to get the runes that I need for that piece of armor that I want. Uh, now uh, let's scour the buildings and check out to see uh, what can we find around before our, uh, uh, before uh, after that I'll enter uh, the dungeons that are uh, on this map long battle bow I think I have that one only if it's four socketed let me check because yeah, if uh, if it's four socketed I think I'll uh, no, it's only one socketed. If it were uh, three, four, uh, four socketed, I would have picked it up. If it's, uh, if it were a three socketed, uh, that would have been uh, discussable. And uh, if it were five sockets, picked up for sure. Two and one socket, uh, not gonna even bother. Let's get some gold. That's a sewers type area, I think. Nothing there, I guess. Not enough mana. I am overburdened. 
as I've said uh, before, a lot of uh, gems. I need to start uh, getting rid of uh, what I really don't need from here uh, and start uh, making a shared sash only for gems, a shared sash only for uh, the runes. Because at this point I'm getting a ton of uh, items. 37 extra gold per monsters, that could be helpful or useful. Uh, to some extent for maybe another character I'll drop there uh, we need mana Nothing here, I guess. Okay, then uh, let's uh, let's check out uh, what's. Uh, it's locked. I don't have any more keys. Well, let's go to town then uh, and buy some. If I remember correctly, uh, probably had uh, the keys in this town. I don't have space, my ass. Sorry about that. I have enough space, but you won't stack them up because I don't know why. Nothing, but I don't want to miss anything, as I've said. Okay, the map uh, is getting um, checked out bit by bit. I think there are a uh, few more places to check. Here, this one, uh, check it out. This is a dungeon, so we have two dungeons, and then a sewer, and then there's uh, that big uh, building over there, which I think that's a dungeon too. Or it could be a dungeon. Oh. Grand Charm. I'm gonna pick that up and uh, go to town, identify it, maybe it's good. Good day!
Okay then, so I'll start uh, uh, clearing the dungeons, then I'll head uh, down into, because I think those are sewers. We need to find the uh, cross bazaar, we're here. Uh, heart in the sewers. Okay, but first let's get to the dungeons, then we'll get to the sewers. I am overburdened. Overburdened. Yes. Yes. Okay, apparently there's nothing here. Stay a while and listen. Hello. I can't carry anymore. I can't carry anymore. to see you. Yes. Good day. Hey, you found the book. It should give all of us here some insight into the nature of the prime evils. Ah, but as for you... All this trouble over a tattered book.
Okay, then I guess uh, we can head to the sewers now, since we need to be there. Stay a while and listen. Good day. Okay, since I found uh, the next uh, area, I'm gonna enter here first, then I'll continue after I uh, come out, I co I'll continue completing uh, the level 1 of the sewers. Found Kalim's heart, and it still bears the courage to face Mephisto. Place it in the Herodric cube along with Kalim's other relics the eye, the brain, and the flail. Yes.
Hello. Good evening. Mana. This place is huge. I haven't uh, cleared the outskirts of the map yet. And then we need to take care of uh, what's in the middle. It's huge and above all looks like a maze to me. Every time I look at it. Okay, so finally we reached a point where I checked. Now let's check everything around.
Greetings. Good day. I can't carry anymore.
Hey, this place uh, seemed, uh, seemed, uh, seems completed, clear. Found another rune, good thing that I uh, clicked on that. Okay, now uh, I am let me try to find the exit. Not sure if I came from here. No, it's kind of the same thing. Problem. Okay, uh, I guess I'll go to town. And that's gonna be it uh, with uh, this live stream. The rest part, uh, the rest of the act will be completed in the next uh, live stream. Let me make sure that I uh, don't need anything. Good day. Time stock up on everything. Okay, let me go repair. We reached level 56. We're going strong towards 61. Uh, really, I don't have enough place. Enough place, enough space. Okay, so uh, as I said, I'm gonna end this stream over here, so uh, 